This is 1989. 1989. I read the data sheet on it before. Yeah, you think you're, that's about it. This old. is a 1989 Carrier Tech 2000 Straight Cool Central Air Conditioner, two tons. I wonder how big my grandmother's is. I think that was bigger. That's probably about two and a half. Yeah, because so she has. The yeah, they did the garage, or it could be a three ton. Though this this one actually has a bigger condenser uh, coil yeah. than the other one. Yeah, I've never had a. It's quiet. Yep. Uh, no, 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 no. That's a separate thing. That's a separate thing. I, I completed like these uh, these two introductory courses at a uh, at a tech school, like night classes. And then I'm gonna go uh, do like Penco Tech or something, or Universal Technical Institute next uh, spring. And then I still got to get the EPA certification. That's totally separate from college. I'm majoring in journalism. And videos of air conditioners are extremely popular on YouTube. I haven't even figured out why yet. So the house didn't have central air before you put that in, right? And you converted to gas like it used to be oil, but you tapped into public gas? My grandmother's house still has the original boiler from 1957. Yep. A Thatcher. I'm amazed hers has lasted hers has lasted this long. I mean it's just old. It's like 55 years old. See, yeah, that's a carrier tech 2000. Two-ton central air conditioner, straight cool. And I don't know what kind of compressor. You wouldn't know what kind of compressor it has, would you? It, wait, this has a scroll? Because I thought some of the older carriers had reciprocating. Yeah, that's quiet enough that it might actually be a scroll. Copeland? I know they use Copeland reciprocating and they used Copeland scrolls in the in these uh, Tech 2000s. Yeah, this probably has a scroll in it then. The only reason I doubted that for a sec is because I've seen newer ones that have reciprocating compressors in them. But yeah, this sounds like a scroll. Do you remember how much it cost back in the day? Like, what was it, like five grand to put it in? I think it was under four. The installation. That included putting the ducts in? Yeah, And it just shut off. Yeah, I think that's a scroll. Let's see if I can actually see down there. Oh yeah, that's a scroll. That's actually got a scroll in it. I can see it perfectly. It's got a scroll compressor. That's one of the best compressors ever made. Better than the Recips. All right, so a nice little video of a Carrier Tech 2000. Now let's get back to the Ream Classic X. This has been a Stamped Octagon production.